up QT squad and welcome to the Tanisha show. So you already know who I am. Well, I'm going to bring you the dopest, the rawest, and the realest content. So before we get into today's video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and turn on those post notifications so you can know every time your girl posts. So as you've seen in my title today, we are doing some custom one leg bleach jeans, man. Just shop my depot. All this is going down in my description down below. Let's get into this video. So as you already know, you put one leg in the bag so we cannot mess with that leg. We don't want to bleach that leg. We don't want the bleach to even touch that leg. So make sure you have your bag inside out and make sure you tie it super hard and stop it where you don't want the bleach to touch. So this is the part where you use tape to make sure your bag don't do all that slipping and sliding. Of course, now you just repeat on the back. Y'all, I followed the tape for like 20 minutes. So my ends are customs and my holes are custom everything on this is custom ripped by me i'm going to show you in this next clip basically how i did it with scissors and um to the end i'm going to show you how i did it with tweezers so let's just get into so this is basically how i distress i go between the strings now we're about to bleach so i did start off spraying like a normal person how you would normally do this but of course mine didn't want to spray so i had to pour like we were in the hood all right so now we're just going to play around with the bleach to make sure the bleach hits all the spots it's supposed to of course my sprayer now wants to work on the back of the pants so just repeat the process on the back Four hours later y'all I let these sit overnight and oh my gosh my best friend came in and sprayed the bottom but it was, it's cool I like that I'm gonna actually spray it some more to make it a little lighter so if you want your pants to come out light as possible you have to spray as much bleach on there as you can now it's time to wash these bad boys with cold water only so they don't bleach and eat through your jeans now this is how they look wet they look pretty fire don't they i love the ends i love the holes now let's throw these bad boys in the washer to get everything clean make sure there's no more bleach eating through my clothes and let's just see how they turned out oh my god so i'm trying to see how much how much or should i even sell these should we do a giveaway or should we sell these bad boys i think i'm gonna I don't know. I, I don't know what we're going to do. So let's just keep retweezing and, you know, getting our holes to look a lot better, to look a bit more dingier. Man, let, let's just keep watching. So basically, we are de-stressing our holes and a little bit more to make our ripped jeans look a little bit more baggier, make it hang a little bit more. Make it, you know, I don't want it to look so uptight. I want it to hang low, you know, look cool. <laughs> So let's get into our outfit inspo. First, we have our party outfit. Let's just get into these jeans. My favorite part is the backside, if you can't tell. And I do love the bottoms. Now we're getting into our chic fit. This is just, you know, something cute, a bodysuit. And now we have our streetwear, my favorite. You know, I had to throw in the custom jacket. Thanks for watching.